Norgren Workholding have produced a brand new workholding solution. We're here at IMI Critical Engineering to find out exactly how good it really is. Robert, thanks very much for your time today. Now, I'm quite interested to understand why Norgram Workholding and the Adaptic System, why you've effectively started to promote this worldwide. Can you tell me a bit about the journey that you've had? Well, the journey is all about solving customer problems. Um, it's about designing a product that uh, solves customer problems through helping them develop their own system, saving time, money and cost. Now, when I look at the system, obviously uh, it, it's, it's soft jaw, so it's obviously, obviously gripping uh, any type of shape to a certain extent. Is there any other configurations that you can actually use through the system? Yeah, you, you can configure it to whatever shape is required. You, you have round forgings, castings for manufacturing processes. There's a range of products you can hold with that. And I suppose from a uh, health and safety point of view, it, it, obviously if you're using drawers, carrying them around the workshop, or, or even dropping them in the machine, this system adapts to that, doesn't it? Yeah, this system removes that uh, storage of soft jaws. You have all the injuries of setting them up, possible hand injuries during the manufacturing of them. So from a safety point of view, it's, um, it's above what you traditionally would use. And I suppose from a manufacturing point of view, obviously the carbon footprint creating those jaw sets effectively to what you would normally uh, use for work holding, there is a benefit there as well. Yeah, 100%. Um, with that product, once you're set up within a short time, you're ready to go. With traditional soft jaws, you've got to machine them, buy the material in, You've got to have uh, someone available, labour resource, to machine them. So would you say that the, uh, the adaptive system, it, it, it sort of fits into marketplace with more complex jobs or just standard jobs? Uh, it covers the range, to be honest. Uh, within the complex market uh, product range, I would say. And, and when you look at some of the actual jaw options, I mean, obviously a lot of different materials, harder materials and, and, and obviously softer aluminiums. Is there other jaws that you can actually use on this system to, to hold the actual piece? Yeah, you could, you could change your jaws to different, a range of different materials, depending on your requirements, whether you have uh, part machine faces that you want to hold gently with, say, a 3D printed insert, or whether you want a hard jaw for that clamping force. And when you see um, this type of system, obviously within the company that's manufacturing, obviously you're proving this out as yes. well as some of your partners as well. Yes, we're um, our own internal customer. We've been trialling it and our outside um, sources have been trialling it and we've been getting feedback from them, which has helped to develop it. So really you're continually uh, trying to put that information back to the manufacturing plant to, to make the best it can be? Yeah, 100%. It's a feedback loop from the customer uh, their demand, what they require, and that's been uh, designed to suit. And, and when you look at uh, traditional systems, for instance, for, for milling components effectively, what, what, what is the drawback uh, to those compared to the adaptive system? The drawback of traditional machining, you know, you have the time in producing the soft jaws, and sometimes you need, you don't know what you need until you need it, and this provides you with the flexibility and adaptability to do that. And from your extensive engineering background, um, do you see this uh, as, as a, a quick fix for a lot of customers and a more cost effective longer term? Oh, yeah, definitely. The, the cost savings from your time, your labour rates, even your machine uptime, you know, they say traditionally you're not making money until your spindle's cutting and this reduces that downtime. And for any engineers that are looking for, they say, new work holding solutions, what would be your message to them? Uh, give it a try. Send in your your requirements, your needs, and that will be able to adapt to it.